guys, it's me Kate again. So this video is my uh, future classics book tag. So let's start. Uh, the question number one is pick uh, an established classic that you think uh, will still be relevant in the future. Charlotte's Web by uh, A.B. White in which you are following a piglet who befriends a spider uh, named Charlotte and it teaches us of actually uh, how some friendships can be unlikely but still beautiful. And we have a uh, pick a recent book which you felt has gone under the radar but which you consider will be uh, a future classic. Um, Dark Cries by C.S. Packard in which you are following a boy who is an orphan working at the docks up until one day when he meets this group of people who are actually trying to protect the world of Dark, Rose, Dark Lord rising up again. Then we have pick a title that won one of your favorite book prizes recently which you think will be loaded in 50 years time. I really don't know any book that won prizes. Uh, pick a recent book you haven't read yet but uh, which you think might become a classic based on the reputation. Any of Brandon Sanderson books really. And the last question is pick a, f a future book that you uh, pick a favorite book that you would uh, say to your grandchildren or friends grandchildren to read um, uh, in 50 years time. There is Vampire by Abigail Gibbs, which bought by Lisa Casey. There uh, cries by C.S. Packard and Spellslinger by Sebastian de Castell. In the other for Vampire we are following a girl named Violet who one day while waiting for her friends, uh, Venus is a brutal, brutal massacre of about 20, 30 men by these six guys who turn out to be vampires. And they take her, her with them to their house and it turns out one of them is vampire heir to the throne and one of the others is his younger brother. Uh, which about is about Sebastian uh, who is a kitsune which is Japanese nine tailed fox spirit with elemental magic. Uh, and uh, he has been on the run ever since something happened to him uh, a year ago up until now and he bumps into an alpha werewolf named Liam who actually saved him a year ago. And Spellsinger is about Kellen who is just about to take his major shell but his magic starts failing. Uh, so he decides to cheat. And that's it for this video. If you like, please like. And if you liked it, please like, share and subscribe. Don't my social media, my email and some other stuff. And I'll see you in the next video.